One of the first things that we're asked as an artist is, what inspires you? Now the list is long. I can think of so many things from music to hip hop, divine femininity, just being a black woman. But I can show you better than I can tell you. So today I'm gonna show you a little bit about how an artist thinks, specifically me. Welcome creators, I'm Aramis the Artist. the hairs on our little chin and chin chin okay I have never ran that fast in my adult life we literally almost missed our plane so glad that we made it and one of the big things that inspires me is travel now of course with the panini press that has clearly been limited but I'm so grateful that outside is open again so we flew from Seattle to Boston and then all the way to Montego Bay one of my favorite things about travel is really the plane ride. I just love looking out the window and seeing the sky and seeing the land and really just seeing the entire universe at work. And this right here is truly one of my favorite moments on a plane. This was my first time ever visiting Jamaica. I feel like I'm behind in life, but we made it. And I was so excited because we were celebrating my mom's wedding. And so pulling up to the country was just absolutely incredible. Another key element that inspires me is definitely nature and mother earth. So seeing this landscape as we were on the plane was truly stunning. Just the world. Just, just the world. Trying to get it together. Hold on, world. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. For real. I'll figure it out. First lady. Thank you. Yeah. The world needed to hold on for real. Okay, because it was a journey. Y'all, let's just say we brought 30 black people from the south side of Chicago on an international trip to celebrate my mom's wedding. <laughs> of course, this is exciting and we were happy to do it, but you know. It had its ups and downs. <laughs> Like people could be chilling up in here. Man, and that view though. Abyss. 
this was the first day that we arrived and we were definitely exhausted so thankfully the itinerary was extremely light the only thing that was on my agenda was hit the J on the beach and look up at the stars that brings me to the next thing that inspires me on my creative journey the cosmos as some of you all might know, I recently finished a Zodiac series, so I love astrology and astronomy. So me and Andy was just chilling out on the beach and looking up at the sky. The sky is crazy, babe. Right? What planet is that? The sky that you right You think so? Jupiter do me hella bright. Maybe Mars though, it's giving kind of red when you zoom in on it. Mm. I can't see from my naked eye. Uranus? Who says Uranus? Uranus, like that big, like. Uranus? You know they did officially change it to Uranus. Get the f out of here. It's funny because that's also kind of the joke. Like, all right, everybody, we've officially divided. Uranus is now Uranus. When was this? Probably, they're probably the same workers I've decided to do. No right. <laughs> I don't know what gets with the authority, but I'm assuming Babe, they're smarter. The shit's wild. our first official day first day we'll take at least second okay here's the bride, to the bride. okay look, to the bride. okay you ready There was so much food. Y'all, I had to have gained five pounds in five days. This was an all-inclusive resort, so included the food, the drinks, shuttles. I'm really glad all of that was inclusive. Um, you know, I like super piping hot food, so buffets don't always provide that, but the staff was really sweet, and you know, there was a few people every now and again who weren't the best, but I feel like overall, I would definitely come back to this spot. Okay. <laughs> and no i'm not affiliated with them in any way nobody's like we paid our own money to go just giving y'all some of my honest feedback on the resort she cute? She got her little body yada 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 <laughs> this is beautiful isn't it Isn't it? So literally this is where it's gonna be. Send me that video, Yama. Okay, this is the bride to be. My say hey to the tube team. This is where it's gonna be. <laughs> what is this? Look at the Look mountains, y'all. Oh my goodness. goodness. Stunning. Stunning. I love it. Yeah. I love it. I don't know that little girl. I'll be sitting here like I love right. it. I love it. Her hair analysis is beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, we did the we did the curls today. Y'all did like a little soft beach wave. Mm -hmm. Hair is another huge inspiration for my creative process, and I believe that topic deserves an entire video of its own. So stay tuned. Is where the wedding is gonna be, and this is the demo. So my thing, what they're gonna do is set the chairs up here. Friends of the welcome you here this afternoon as we gather in the presence of God to witness and to celebrate the marriage of union between Brandel and Catherine. I am just so proud of my mom. She has always been an incredible example for me to live your life to the fullest, to have fun and be your most courageous and funny and wild self. And this was just so beautiful to witness her and Randy's love. Take 
the ladies in red. Look, yeah. the ladies in red. Look, now you ready. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. After the wedding, we all went back to our separate rooms and we changed our clothes because the color for the evening was red, baby. Red from head to toe. That's my mom's favorite color. And that brings me to the other thing that inspires my work is color. I literally challenge myself to see how many colors I can use in one painting. <laughs> I know that's not um, the conventional model of how to create, but I just love color so much. Colors just make me so happy and make me feel good. The Jamaican ganja is a yes for me. It was such a beautiful euphoric high. <laughs> to me, I thought that it was better than West Coast weed. Like the West Coast, it's just too strong out here for me. In Jamaica, we was just vibing out, just good vibes. I gotta admit, we were those people who mostly stayed at the resort during our stay in Jamaica, but it was so beautiful. I mean, how could you blame us? So we had some chill, just poolside days where we went swimming and went to the beach as well. But then we eventually got outside and left the resort to go and hang out with the locals. <laughs> <laughs> you said it's what? Scary. Oh yeah, absolutely, it's scary. You feel like you're driving on the opposite yeah, side of traffic. Right? Oh my God. Oh, well for you, it's like. One of the excursions that we went on was the catamaran boat ride and it was so much fun. The ride was a little bit bumpy to say the least, but it was definitely the highlight of the trip for me. much fun don't ask me why <laughs> i was standing up on this rocky ass boat with a with a cup of alcohol in my hand over my cousin with her cell phone dripping dripping my drink on her okay shout out to the fam for being patient <laughs> for being sweet we was just having so much fun highly recommend the catamaran boat rides yeah andy tried to tell me but i wouldn't listen i was just too souped up on the music that brings me to another thing that inspires my creative process and that is a thousand percent music wifey's on board. Let me I'll make some noise right Woo! now. All right, big shout outs to all the wives. All the single ladies on the boat. Let me y'all make some noise right now. All the single ladies, all the 
All right, stop. But for right now, let me just play a song for the side chicks. Let's go. Oh, sorry, the single ladies. I got y'all right where I wanted y'all. Hey, hey. All single ladies. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, yeah, yeah, because pretty much he said don't do 150. So it's 70? Oh, that's good. Yeah, at the hotel they charge 150. For the whole bottle. For the bottle, for the, for the bottle of pure white Hennessy. Y'all, do not judge the sweat, okay? We just left the Dunn River Falls. It was amazing. Why do we almost die? <laughs> I'm like, do I need to die today? Like, is that what we going for? We are at the souvenir store. Hey, what is this place called? No, it's called Rainbow Stores. Okay, I think it's Rainbow Stores. Really good stuff, y'all. Really good prices because at our hotel, we're staying at the Bahia Principe. It's beautiful. It's really nice, but the alcohol is expensive. So, they got really good prices here. This is spot to go. Yeah, we turned up on the boat. Did y'all see it? Did I show y'all footage? Did I show y'all footage? Show footage? <laughs> Why am I so dramatic, though? <laughs> We didn't almost die at the Dunn River Falls, but we had a blast. It was a little scary. It was I was nervous. It was about 15 of us going up this extremely tall and slippery waterfall with other people and children around. But we made it and it was a whole lot of fun. By the end of the day, we were exhausted. So I was really excited to just get back to the resort and chill on out. Straight out of Jamaica, <laughs> I love that. That's cute. Make it funky. Okay, so I know this video is completely different from all of my others, but y'all know I'm always searching for clarity and I feel like in expanding my channel and the style of content will provide so many different opportunities for me to show you all how I really create in my life and how all of my surroundings are really impacting my art and my creative practice. So, and some of you all might know that my new shop is launching soon on February 3rd, 2023. And so what I've been doing is kind of testing out some of the products. I wore the robe to Jamaica the robes aren't gonna launch yet y'all I'm thinking I don't know okay I don't even want to say a date and be wrong but it was really nice having the robe out in this tropical setting and seeing what the vibe would be so stay tuned for the future because I definitely plan on incorporating a lot more art creativity and lifestyle into my content This trip was such an incredibly needed break, reset, restoration to my creative process, and really just mindset in general. At the beginning of the year, we're always thinking about what are some of our goals and what do we wanna do. I know for sure my added goal is definitely gonna be travel more. This restored me in a way that I was not even prepared for. I couldn't even imagine and I couldn't even expect. And I'm excited to take you all with me to new and different places that I go throughout the entire world. Let me know if you all have some travel in your future and what you are excited about for the new year.
<laughs> this is my best life right here coloring sea creatures <laughs> I am gonna miss this view. It was amazing. I'm coming back to Jamaica, okay? This is about to be my second home, baby. All right, we just been chilling, living our best life. Yeah, the Bahia Principe is nice. It's definitely nice. You know, nowhere is perfect. <laughs> nowhere is perfect. If you want perfection, then don't live. Stop living, okay? But overall, I think we had a really, really great time, especially with a group of 30 black people from the shy. Okay. <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay. Y'all, get one last look. Now we're about to hit this J again and chill out before we have to check out and go back to Seattle. It's gray and gloomy. Where it's gray and gloomy. Oh, this was great though, this is just what I needed. <laughs>